Hello programmers and old notepad users. This is uh know it all I'm back with another video. This video is a nice little program that most people know about if they code or do like anything like HTML. And it's something that they should really consider using and it's just Notepad Plus Plus. What is Notepad Plus Plus? Well, Anyone who's used Notepad before, whether it's in school or anything else, has probably gone through at least one instance in a computer class where they've used Notepad to code HTML. Well, that's a great little program because it's so simple, but it's not directly set up for this, so... Ah, uh, crap, it's been a while. I don't know anything. Uh, I don't know any code off the top of my head. It's, I haven't done this in years, but... um, You... Basically, it's just a simple little thing. It'll run multiple things. It's just like, you know, got a spell check, or it's just something really simple. And yet, at the same time, you can launch it in all of these. I mean, it's such a simple programming. If you want, if you like to code from scratch, it's definitely going to be something that you want. And uh, I, I like it. It's just a little simple program. I, if I ever got back into it, I would definitely use this like HTML, and then it was uh, ah crap, is it uh, I haven't done this in forever. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, I believe that's the code for it and then you always do a backslash and then this isn't going to work let's just uh... let's just try to run it that's weird hmm Interesting. I, I, I don't seem to know what it is. Under, oh, herp the derp. I know what I did wrong. You just same it as. I don't put spaces in. I don't want you to do spaces in these. It even comes with a bunch of form like Flash application. It does a lot. JavaScript. I think it's even got C. Yeah, it's got all the programming lang languages. It's like truly a cookie it, it's just like if you just want to like code from directly from scratch this is what you're going to use um i don't see html so i'm just gonna do it this way and add the extension myself now what did i do wrong eh. see this this is what it means if you like If you're an old vet at this, then what the crap? What did I do wrong? I don't know if this is an error or what. No. Okay, so I'm just going to run. And that's simple. It's a simple little thing. Oh, I'm stupid. I don't need to specify that it's a uh, HTML document. And then I can just say, was it S and then P? You always put a backslash and then you just hit. This should be, this is backslash space and then you all reading this. I don't know. How is it going? And then always go. Whenever you want to end a command line, always put a backslash. It knows that it, when it reads it, that's how it's going to know that it's not there. Hello, Ron. And where's this? Now, if I hit run, launch night, internet explorer. Well. Wait a second, wait. You don't. However, I 
think if I do that, it should make a space. Told you it's been a long time since I bothered to do this. Nope. It's reading. It's like skipping the entire line. Hold on and launch night. Hmm. Oh. Nope. Nope. See? See, I made a really stupid mistake. I didn't save it. This is to start a new paragraph. Go and then online. Now control S and now run. Oops. Launch an IE. And P is to the next space. Okay, well, as you can see, this is a really basic little tool. I like it. I need to learn some more. I need to get back into it and just remember how to do basic code and then maybe I can always do a little tutorial on that I guess maybe maybe I will but uh yeah thank you for watching uh hope you liked what you saw if you ever need any more uh if you need any help in the future or are looking for more programs like this uh, stay tuned I have a couple more programs I want to review and I'm going to uh post them here and on the website so uh Thank you for watching, and goodbye.